Okay, this fitness challenge is going to make use of movement. We're actually going to be doing some, some uh, lunging movements, forward lunging, side lunging, and backward lunging. Uh, we can use a towel uh, as a guide. Initially, when you're first learning to do this, you want to keep your arms up, keep your back straight, and then you're going to step forward. The trick here is to step as far forward as you can comfortably, and that will decrease the pressure on your knee. If you, step, if you step close and try to lunge, there tends to be a lot of torque on the knee. So the trick is to step out further, lunge down, the back knee can either stay bent or it can stay straight depending upon what you're trying to accomplish and how you feel about it. But step forward, bring it down, and push back. You want to breathe in, inhale as you step forward, exhale as you come back. My preference after I do this is normally I like to alternate, but I showed you several repetitions on one leg, so I'll just continue that theme. Big breath in, exhale back. To show it from the front, it's inhale, step, and push back. Inhale, step, and push back. You can make this more challenging by bringing your arms over your head as you take that forward step and bring it back. Big breath in, hold it up overhead, and bring it back. From the side, big breath in, exhale back, big breath in, Exhale back. You also can take the towel, loop your hands around it, push your arms out as you step forward, pull them back. Push your arms out forward, inhale, of course, exhale, pull back. Big breath in, exhale back. Big breath in, and exhale back. Now, if you're really emphasizing the pushing, the pulling, you'd simply reverse the breathing and breathe in deep as you pull and exhale as you push. Depends on you as to what you're emphasizing. The other way you can do this is you can make it even more challenging by walking with this. This first one is a stagger step lunge, also called wedding march lunge. Here you can bring the arms up to here, hold that position, bring it back to your start, and you're moving forward. Bring it up, back to your start, and back to your start. Back to your start. You can make that more challenging by not stopping in between. Bringing it up, pulling it all the way through, kicking it out, all the way through, kick it out, all the way through, kick it out, and so on. You also can do this walking sideways. Step out, bring it down, step up, step out, bring it down, step up, step out, step out. Step out. And of course, you've got to go the other direction as well. So this is a side walking lunge. Good for the hips. Lateral movement. And again, if you wish, you can make it more challenging by bringing the arms up overhead as you do it. Inhale down, exhale up. Inhale down, exhale up. Inhale down, exhale up. Reverse the sequence. If your shoulders are getting tired, or your back is starting to feel fatigued because of the overhead movement, you can bring the towel in front, bring it here, push it out, pull it back, push it out, pull it back, push it out, pull it back, push it out, pull it back. The trick here is to use as much muscle mass as you can in a given movement. So you're using lower body as well as upper body in this walking movement. So that's an excellent fitness challenge. Give it a try.